Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. This is Sukanya, your storyteller. So today I have brought a very interesting story for you and that is the secret of the season. Now all of you have read about seasons. But do you know how the seasons came about? Let's hear the story. This is the story of Persephone, who was the daughter of Demeter, the Greek goddess of harvest. Demeter would look after the growth of plants and crops on earth. She worked hard to make sure that the people of earth always had a plentiful harvest. Persephone was a cheerful girl. She helped her mother in all her works. She was beautiful and went about her work singing softly to herself. Demeter was proud of her daughter and enjoyed spending time with her. One day, the ruler of the underworld, Pluto, caught a glimpse of Persephone and was struck by her beauty. He wanted to marry her. He approached Zeus, the king of the gods, and asked for his permission to marry Persephone. Zeus knew that Demeter would never agree to her daughter's marriage to Pluto and avoided giving him an answer. Pluto was very disappointed at Zeus' unwillingness to give him an answer. One evening, Persephone was gathering flowers in the garden all by herself. Finding her alone, Pluto kidnapped her and took her down to Hades, the underworld where he lived. This dark and dismal place was guarded by Cerberus, a three-headed dog. Demeter was very upset at the disappearance of her daughter. She neglected her work and wandered about, searching for her everywhere. The crops withered and died, and the inhabitants of Earth had no food at all. When she came to know that Persephone had been kidnapped by Pluto, she approached Zeus and pleaded to him to get her daughter back. Zeus at once ordered Pluto to free Persephone and send her back to her mother if she had not eaten any food in Hades. The wild Pluto tempted Persephone to eat a few juicy pomegranate seeds. Persephone, who was tired, thirsty and hungry, finally gave in and ate six of the seeds. This meant that she now had to spend six months with Pluto in the underworld and six months with her mother on earth. Thus, every year during the peak of winter, Persephone is in underworld with Pluto and her mother Demeter does not tend to the crops at all. Earth is then covered with snow and the plants wither away and die. When Persephone returns to earth, her mother is enjoyed to see her and goes about her work with a song on her lips and a spring in her step. The flowers start blooming once again and the crops flourish. The people of earth are happy for they have a good harvest and enough food for the whole year. So the next time you see the fragrant roses and colorful daisies in the garden, you know that Persephone and her mother are having a great time together.